guys, just slowly chipping away. I've got um, oh, a little bit of time each night before dark, so I've been kind of just working away at this. And uh, this particular one has a kind of a U-shaped channel in it. And uh, just uh, rough cut out the center, chiseling that out, getting it out of the way. And once I get a little bit lighter, I'll uh, take it over to the table saw. Because I started out trying to cut it on the table saw, and it's just, it's just way too big of a beam. My saw was not liking that, so. Anyhow, uh, working on beam number two. Well, good morning, guys. We're doing a bunch of prep, uh, getting ready for our beams to go up. Our dog is very excited about that. Got a bunch more prep that needs done. Need to finish ripping out this little section. Uh, through here that's going to be in the way get uh, the old nails and stuff trimmed out and ready to go and we got the drywall and everything uh, ready to go here this wall has been open for quite a while so it's uh, it's nice to finally get that closed up also had a big chunk open um, above the door here and then back where we took out uh, that window and and shortened this window here so this is all going to get closed up today since we're already making a mess with drywall and everything uh it was a good time to uh, finish up this little chunk of drywall here i have a lot of patching to do beans up there. Yep. So we've got all the bracing out of the way. Yep. And new bracing so our ceiling doesn't fall down. Sludge. Yeah, so we'll need to tap the base in. Okay. It's really close, it should pop right up. Okay. Oops. Oh, just a sledgehammer. I hate the word sledgehammer because of that stupid song, mm. Sledgehammer. Yeah. Because every time I hear sledgehammer, then I'm like, sledgehammer. Putting some of these big lags up in there. I've got uh, my post will be out to about right here, and so this will be hidden, <clears throat> and I'm gonna screw this up into our uh, our top plate there, just as a little extra insurance. And I'm gonna zap it up in there, and then we'll get everything squared up over here. Very cool. All right, now let's get the other side up. Persuaded a little. Sure. 
All right, so we're pounding this beam in and Beauty came up with a good little trick for us. So we're uh, trying it out, it's working real well. Uh, we're putting dish soap down below to help kind of uh, lubricate the beam as it slides in. It's be working pretty good. Yeah, it's working really well. Whack-a-mole, yep. Getting Going close. Good. Almost there. Yep. there you have it beams are up and in I still have to do the uh, braces but uh, overall <laughs> pretty excited to have those up and in so much of cleanup to do and uh, we'll uh, get to working on those cross braces another time but for now uh, this will do just fine I gotta do some uh, work on the cabinets uh, this one needs notched about uh, an inch because when I designed the cabinets I hadn't planned on a beam right here. So I notched that over a little bit and then uh, this cabinet here will get uh, notched out uh, for that uh, beam to go behind it. So anyhow, thanks for coming along guys. We will catch you on the next video.